Hello and welcome, my name is Parky and today I'm playing some more Spore. Now last episode we got into the creature stage and... What the hell is going on here? Why are there eggs floating in the air? Like, well that seems like the least of our worries. Um, last time, <laughs> that's a bit weird, um, we killed a few creatures that attacked our home base and we also made friends with all these ones in these nests around us. Now we collected a few parts, um, so I would quite like to do a mating call just to see what we've got in case we can upgrade a few things, because we've got quite a few DNA points now. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, but people seem to have quite a good reaction to this, so I'm going to carry on doing it. I'm really glad, actually, because I love this game. And everyone seems to love it too. Now, there's been quite a few suggestions as to what I should make my character look like, or my creature even. Uh, some of them are quite varied, I'm not going to lie. There's ones like, make a slug mollusk thing, and then there's like, make an, a human with spikes on his back, and other weird things, but I can't really do all of that. Uh, what I might do... Does this actually cause any difference whatsoever? I suppose it doesn't, really. I might keep them as the black eyes, because I kind of... I, I like the black eyes. Okay, let's look at mouths. Now, last time I think we used... was it this...? I think it was this one. Sing one, bite three, sing... See, these would technically be better. Actually, which one am I using? Hmm. Oh, good dear god. Okay, well, I think we might go for this one, because we're going to go for... a singing person. In fact, I think that might have been actually the same line of mouths that I used before anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, how is this going to work? Ooh. It's like Sylvester Stallone again. Did we say that last time? I can't even remember. I kind of like it though, so I'm going to leave it there. <laughs> uh, we've got some new legs. Speed. There's no difference whatsoever. Now we have got the... what are these, like, exoskeleton limbs? I don't know what these give you. Nothing. They just look different. I might I might put these on. Do they just look different? Is that the only difference? Fleshed. Jesus Christ. It's a bit of beefcake, isn't it? <laughs> Don't worry, I think I think we might change how these look just slightly. Uh, just so it doesn't look completely retar retarded even. Retarded? Dear god. Okay, so we'll just shrink these down a little, a little bit. Because we don't want him looking too ridiculous. He says as making them look completely ridiculous. I think we might need to make the hands a little bit smaller. <laughs> it's really difficult, this, to get it looking like not completely spazzy. There you go, that's alright. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Then we've got graspers. I think we used one of these. Was it that one? I think it might have been. So let's now replace it with this one. Like so. Make it a little bit smaller. Hmm, it looks a bit weird with the arms. It sort of overlaps a little bit. There's nothing we can do about it. Uh, I think we used this one as well. Dance level 2, sprint 1, speed 2. Dance 3, speed 3, sprint... Yeah, okay, so that's just a lot better all round. So we'll put these on and make them a tad smaller and maybe splay them a little bit. Splay them. I like that as a word. Or oh, No, we're going to have small claws. Then weapons. Now, we can add whip weapons. Uh, someone said add a spit thing. I don't know if I'm actually going to be using that, though. I'll come back to that in a second. Details. Now we have a little whippy tail, so we can actually upgrade that to give us charm 3, which will obviously help us. So we'll put that there. So now it's got a little three-pronged tail. In fact, let's make it big. Yes. Like so. I actually really like the shape of this character, so I'm not going to change too much. We could give him more health. We'll give him some little kneecaps. There we go. Now, I'm not sure exactly how this works. I think... Um, it just takes into account the highest level 1 that you put on there. So if I now put, like, a level 1 um, health on it, it won't do anything. I think. 
If I add more, does it add any more? No. Okay, so yeah, that you only need one of each. In fact, I don't really like it on his knee pads. I might give him like a, a nice chest piece. N although not quite so dramatic. Yeah, there we go. Yes, yes. Right, what else? We've got charm level 2. What's our charm level 3? We could do with better mouths, actually. That's sort of lagging behind the others. Pose level 3. Yeah. It's a shame, really. So we don't actually have any... Yeah, we don't have many mouths. Damn. Okay, now is that... Someone suggested, I think, putting more spikes on this guy. Let's just have a look at these. So we've got charge level 1, bite 2. Charge level 1, health 1. Charge 2. Well, we might as well change these up anyway. No disadvantage in doing so, is there? And then what else have we got? We've got bite. But I suppose that comes from the mouth. We could have strike. Tell you what, in case we get in a sticky situation, we might as well have that as well. We could make him like a weird unicorn type thing. Ooh, doesn't look too bad. Oh, I like that. It's like, um, what's his face? Um, Margin Boo from Dragon Ball Z. But sort of... Ooh. So, do you see what I mean? If you know the show and you've watched it, it kind of looks like the thing on his head. <laughs> it just looks a bit derpy. Okay, let's change how he looks in terms of his paint scheme. Some people might get a bit annoyed that I'm spending so long on this, but... I like getting him right. This is what Spore is. This is what the main part of the game is, creating things that look interesting. I think that looks kind of nice, actually. I'm going to have a look through the others, see if there's any others that look funky. Oh, no, I'm not sure about that. What does this look like? Oh, yeah, I like that. Yes. Yes, we're going to have that for now. Yes. He's looking so happy. Look at his face. Look at his... Scary, um, <laughs> mollusk face. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know what I was trying to say there. Oh, we're migrating. God, we are so sexy. Um, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. I like how big your eyes are. It's well sexy. <laughs> it's just me and this egg now. Oh, no, that's not me, is it? Because I am technically in the egg. Okay, well, we don't care about any of this, so use your mini-map to help you navigate the world. You can find your nest, food, and migratory path here. Now, where exactly? Oh, we're going to have to learn new things, aren't we? There we go. Let's just get this out of the way quickly. He's very happy with me. Is that it? I don't think we added anything else. Yep, there we go. So who is in my pack at this stage? This guy. Now we can, we might as well just add this guy to the pack as well, um, as we have an additional space on the right hand side. There you can see. It's just scratching my my beard. Right. Are you actually in my pack or not? Oh no, you're not. There we go. It's always an advantage to have your pack full. It makes everything a lot easier. And makes it harder for you to kill in the long term anyway. Now, someone else mentioned... Um, let's follow this path. We'll, we'll migrate to the new nest. Someone else mentioned in the comments for the last episode that if I come across a rogue character, um, I should get him in my team, which I will do. Um, obviously, <laughs> you must understand, I've played this game many times. I know of all of these things. I may be a bit derpy sometimes, um, but yes, I, I know what rogue characters are. And just to explain what that is, um, a rogue character, you'll just see these big... Um, they're like just big, single creatures that roam the world. And they're really strong, and they have really good traits. So they're good to have in your party. We might as well make friends with people along the way. We'll pick up some more bits. Um, come here. Come here. We're going to impress you. Oh, he's calling his posse over. Oh, God, which one is that? That's Charm, isn't it? Owned. Unfortunately, because we are higher level, it's sometimes it's harder for the um, other creatures to make friends with us. Um, so obviously, but we make up for it ourselves, so it doesn't matter. Okay, come here, you Silinianos. Silinianos <laughs> sounds Italian. He's got his whole posse here this time. 
Do a bit of, a bit of posing. Yeah, this will be fine now. They really like posing. And pose again. Good. I'm just going to pick up these bones. Actually, there's quite a few bones around here. Uh, is there an alpha one of these? Ah, I just saw it. Let's do it with the alpha, because then we get another part anyway. Dancing. I can do that. Oh, yeah, we're pretty good. What's that? That's... Charm, isn't it? I always get the charm and pose confused. It's not really obvious which one's which. I suppose pose is... Oh, fuck, I did the wrong thing. That's right, we can still do this. They're not happy, but we can do it. Right, we'll sing this time. There we go. Perfect. So that was a nice chunk. So let's go over here, grab our bones. And we got a new mouth. Hopefully that's actually one of the new mouths, like, beyond the one I've got. Um, that would be nice. It means that we can get our sing level up. Um, I saw these ones over here. Might as well go and do these. They look incredibly derpy. Wow. Mind you, I can't really speak, can I? Alpha Fatty O. <laughs> What's that? That's Pose, right? Yeah. Well, so someone else mentioned um, the fact that I had the bad data error. Um, I've changed that in the game file, so you don't have to worry about that. Everything should now have names properly, um, which is exactly what we wanted. So that won't be a problem later on in the space stage. The problem with that glitch is the fact that... Um, oh, wow, well, I got the next up. That's good. Yeah, the problem with that glitch is that in the space stage and civilization stage, literally every planet and like species has the bad data name, which is just obviously wrong. So, yeah. We won't have to worry about that anymore. God, look at that. Good at dancing. Actually, no. Forget him. Do the other alpha. Hello. Are you going to... I bet you dance. Oh, God. Silly person. What does this little star with the three in mean? Does that mean the number of people in his pack? I assume it does. Let's do a bit of posing. Because we're so fine and sexy. Right, pose. I don't, I don't know what's happening with my voice. It's just sort of going all over the place. Right, and there we go. Perfect. We're advancing pretty damn quickly. Uh, they're all running away, which sort of suggests that there's a big monster coming behind me. Um, but we're going to get these bones and then turn around. Oh no, it's a meteor strike. Okay. That's fine. Don't look like something floating in the river there. Oh no, here's all the little bits flying down. Perfect. Ah! Is that... Is that an alpha thing? Oh no, okay, these are just... I, th I thought that was not an alpha, that was um, a rogue, but it's not. God, how weird. You might as well make friends with it. It looks terrifying. Oh yeah. Lay those beats down. That's right. Actually, can we do it with him again because he's still like indifferent? Oh no, okay, he's obviously too happy. Uh, if we go and make friends with this guy. Oi you, I want to be your friend. Come here. Pose. There you go. And a bit of singing. Perfect. And is there one more? There is. It looks like they've lost their alpha. Doesn't really matter. Pose. <laughs> Dear God. I think we might have this one. This is good though, that was a lot of DNA. And our brain has grown. Now, I'd like to try and get through this stage today, but I think we might just fall short. But I'll see what I can do. If not, we'll finish at the very start of next episode and move into the tribal stage. Tribal stage is actually one of my favourites. Wow, all that DNA has gone to your head. Your extra large brain means that you can now add a third creature to your pack. 
That is really cool. Okay, so we can now get a third creature. Uh, we'll have to wait until we actually get to our um, posse, our new home. But first, we might as well make friends with these other people, because... Well, they're here, and they're probably quite easy to make friends with. It's all free DNA. Right, so let's go for the alpha. Glorfindel. He's gathering his posse. Problem now is that because I've gone up a tier, it means that other creatures do also sort of level up a little bit, so it's harder to make friends with them. Yeah, see, look, these guys are really good at singing. I bet they do it again. Ah, oh, damn it. No, we're not going to be able to get these guys. We might as well just give up and make our way over to these ones. Yeah. Might as well. God, that looks terrifying. Some of these creatures are really, like, quite scary looking. Momo. I wonder how good this guy is. Oh, he's got three in his pack. Oh, that mouth. Nope, I think the downfall here is the fact that we only have two pack members. So we might well have to just walk to our new base. And apparently we can't walk up a, like, a slight slope, which is really annoying, but whatever. We'll have to walk around this side. Why are all these guys angry? Are they fighting? Hmm, alright. Ah! Oh, these guys are angry. Let's not go near them. Ah, too late. We might as well wipe them out. Tell you what, yep, let's do it. Simple. And now let's go over here. We might as well. Like, there's, there's no disadvantage doing this sort of stuff. Why can't we, sh we charge? Have we got rid of our charge ability? How are we doing? Are we going to die? We're on 23. Ah, oh, we've got this. We can do this. If we just kill, like, that baby, they'll all just despawn. There we go, that's one more. Let's go after that baby. Oh god, we've almost lost him as well. We'll have to be quick. Kill the baby! Kill it! Oh god, we might even die here. Ah, there we go. Thank god. And you'll see they all just disappear. Oh, we sort of missed it, but it doesn't matter. Okay, we'll pick up this. What's this? Why is there a plus, a home plus seat symbol? Oh, I suppose, oh, have we now taken over this nest? Is that how it works? Must be. Okay, well, let's eat a little bit of food. Um, I suppose that got us fairly far, actually. Uh, we might as well migrate to the new nest as well. Uh, we could make friends with them. To be honest, we probably don't need to. And let's just have a look around. Yeah, we can probably get over the hill here. Only got one pack member though. Are these guys aggressive or not? They look very aggressive. They're not actually. We will take their bones and incorporate them in our structure. Okay. Looks like we're almost here. Or maybe not. Who knows? But we definitely can't um, befriend any of these guys because they've got far too many pack members. Unless we come across some really like flimsy ones, but I doubt that. Looks like these guys are migrating as well. Frog boy. Um, okay, they look very threatening. We'll just sort of skip past them. Uh, these guys are fairly threatening as well. Uh, we're probably going to lose our other pack member. Oh dear god, run! They've got stun, and I'm being attacked by two separate places, and now I'm probably going to die. Run! Run! God damn it, I hate the, the creatures with stun. It's so annoying. So yeah, I'm pretty much screwed now. And by stun, I think that's the charge attack, but I'm not sure. Ow. God, we only just managed to get out of there. It might be wise, actually, if we... If, are we being chased? Oh shit, we are. Okay. Yeah, run away. Our other pack member can take the damage from them. Run, run, run. Just get away from them, please. Problem is, if you die, you go back to your home base. And as we haven't discovered this one yet, 
we're almost there. We can't respawn. We're going to have a little cutscene now. Ah, oh, there we go. Wonderful. Are we making a bigger nest? We are! Yay! <laughs> you have claimed this nest. Future generations will be born here. Well, that seems like a very wonderful place to end it. If you enjoyed the episode, then please feel free to leave a like, comment, or favourite, or even subscribe if you haven't done so already. And tell your friends, because it really helps me. Goodbye, awkward. Awkward goodbye. Awkward. <laughs>